Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Rebecca and today I'm going to be doing some swatches and a first impression of the Marc Jacobs Le Marc lip creams. So a PR representative contacted me a couple weeks ago asking if I would like to try out their spring collection and I said sure so I wasn't really sure what I was going to be getting. And I received seven of the new Le Marc lip creams by Marc Jacobs. So I just kind of want to give you a look at them since they are new. They created a bunch of reds so that different skin tones and undertones can find their perfect red. This collection kind of says one swipe, 10 hours, 20 iconic shades. So there are more shades. I have seven of them that I'll be showing you today. So what you can see on my lips right now is the Je Thème, and we're going to kind of go over what undertones they recommend and the different colors just so you can kind of see them on, see some lip swatches, see some regular swatches. If these swatches go a little too fast, you can pop over to my blog. I'll give you a direct link somewhere on the screen, otherwise it's Rebecca Shores MUA if you just like to see some photos. So if you'd like to see swatches of the Marc Jacobs Pick Your Perfect Red, then keep watching. We're gonna take a look at the packaging real quick. As you can see, it just comes in these beautiful glossy black containers with Marc Jacobs written across the front. You can see here there is a magnetic closure so your lids aren't going to go flying anywhere. And on the bottom they have a color coordinated sticker with the name of the lipstick color and they just twist up very nicely. So as you can see here this is the first color we're going to be looking at which is the color O'Malley. I personally really like the packaging of these just because it's all very sleek with the silver on black. Here are my lips, bare, just so you can see what we're putting the lipsticks over. And here is the swatch of O'Malley oh On. As you can see, it's just a very pretty cool blue red. I actually really like this for anyone that's on the fair side, especially if you have a little more of a cool undertone. And you can see it's got a kind of creamy finish, more like a demi matte. Here's the next color we're going to be looking at. This is the color Je Tame. And this is a very pretty kind of light dusty red. So this is a great color if you're wanting a red, but you're maybe not ready for a full blown red. This is a very wearable red. This is going to work great for daytime or just for people that aren't into a bright red lip. I think this is a very wearable, one of my favorites from this collection. This next color is Goddess. This is a very true red. So this is a just bright red that's gonna be suitable for pretty much anyone because it's got an even amount of those blue and warm undertones. As you can see, again, that beautiful creamy finish and just a very wearable but very true red lipstick. This next one is the color Blow. This is a deep blue-based red. I actually love this color. This is one they recommend for actually darker hair, but I think anyone could wear this. It's also great because this one is going to be one that can easily be worn, something that's gonna be a very bold lip on fair skin tones, but it's something that's gonna have less contrast as something like Je Tame on someone with a deeper skin tone. So this is just all around a great deepened blue-based red. The one downside is with the formula, this one I do find you need to go over about twice because it can go at least slightly patchy. This next color is Corey Cora. This is a very kind of peachy coral red. This is going to be great for people with a slightly warmer skin tone that are wanting a red that's going to be less intense. So if you're on the warmer side and you find something like Jetame being pretty, but you don't like the way dusty colors look on your skin, this is a great alternative. This next color is Ray of Light. This is a kind of tomato rust red. This is something that is going to look great on people with a warmer skin tones and especially people that have a deeper complexion than I do. As you can see, this color is definitely not super flattering for myself, but with someone with a deeper, more warmer skin tone, that's going to be just a gorgeous color. This last one is Miss Scarlet. This is, again, that kind of rusty red that's a little more on even the brownish side. So again, this is going to be great on deeper skin tones as well as people that lean a little more warm. So I hope you found that helpful and then you can kind of 
see a couple swatches, maybe you found a lipstick that you'd like to go try on or anything like that. I think these ones are only sold through Sephora and Marc Jacobs. Let me know what your favorites were in the comments box below. Like I said earlier, these were sent to me. It is not sponsored, but I did receive these as PR samples. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. That really helps me out. You can also subscribe if you'd like to see more videos from me. I have all my social media in the down box below as well as at the end of the video. And I hope to see you guys again next time.